Welcome to my YouTube channel. My name is Sandra. Other people call me Italian boss babe. <laughs> <laughs> I think this is the fifth time to record this because I've been recording and then I make a mistake, I cut it, and then I record and I make a mistake. And then I'm starting off again. So, you know, what's good about it? video on the vlog. Welcome back once again. For those of you who don't know me, I'm a videographer and photographer based here in Arusha. So join the ride and get to know me who I am. By the way, today this is a tutorial video and it has been requested by many people, but among a person who was reminding me from time to time is my young sister. Her name is Nice, so Nice. This video is dedicated for you. And this video is all about how to make a transition, you know, like in your video to get those amazing transitions so your video become very interesting without any further ado let's hit the intro so welcome back once again this video we're gonna edit and i'm gonna show you how to edit your video and edit them transition by using adobe premiere pro um, in your pc so if you're a creator and you're interested in to know how to make amazing transition by using your adobe premiere pro then this is a place for you so welcome without any further ado and here I'm opening my Adobe Premiere Pro and I've already arranged some of the clips which we shoot the other day with my friend um, Sandra, also known as Italian Boss Lady, because she's about to start a YouTube channel out there and then we had to make a short introduction video for her and guys go and subscribe to our channel it's amazing I, I'm gonna leave the link in the description below but also at the end of this video you're gonna see that link so um, let's see if you play the scripts, you can see she's talking from the first script right there. Um, between first script and second script, you see the way they switch is like, it is not that interesting. So we're gonna show you how to add a transition over there to make these videos amazing. So everybody when you look at it, be like, oh my God, this video is so amazing. Can you imagine? Anyway, let's get back to the topic. Before anything, you guys understand about this. Um, transition it has a wide range uh, there are those transitions which a uh, person already made them and they are available online some of them are sold some of them are for free so and here I have some of them I've downloaded them and you can use them and they're easy to manipulate but also there are second group of transitions whereby they come with your program in your PC because um, there are those we call them basic transitions whereby when you install the program you find them in your pc and the third group of transition which is my favorite is your own creation transition so understand this sometime you have to create your own transition in your head and then make it come to life that's also possible but today i'm gonna show you two types of transition the one which i've downloaded and the ones which come with adobe premiere pro so let's start it so between these two clips as you can see the way they skip i want to add something um to make them interesting so the transition which i've downloaded and installed them they all come in this folder called presets up here but the transitions which come with the program they're going to be stored in this folder called video transition down here so when you click the drop down arrow you're going to see all those transitions so let's start with the one which i've downloaded so i'm going to click the drop down arrow and then the, this folder right here is called bb64 then i'm going to click it and as you can see, there are so many types of these transitions. For example, for this one, which is being rated nest, what I'm going to do is I have to nest a clip, the one which, um, the one which uh, ended and the one which started. I'm going to skip five frames from the one which started and five frames from one which ended. So I'm going to zoom in here, these clips. I'm going to make sure the line is stay between these two clips. So from there, I'm going to press shift and forward arrow to skip five frame forward and I'm gonna press Control K to cut the first clip and I'm gonna press shift and back arrow to return into the middle of the two clips and I'm gonna press again shift and the back arrow to go five frame back of the clips and then I'm gonna press Control K so as you can see I have um, five end of the clip of the first clip and five segment of the start of the new clip I'm gonna select those two clips 
and I'm gonna right click and I'm gonna click nest do you see this nest this is the one which is presented by this nest in the brackets back into the transitions so I'm gonna click nest and then I'm gonna press ok so as you can see the two clips become as one and from there is when I'm gonna select one of transition which I'm interested in for example I say lens flare transition number one I'm gonna select it and I'm gonna drop between the nest clip so if I'm leaving it and I'm gonna play back the play so now look how amazing this is um, the transition between first clip and the second one do you see that it's like blinking that kind of lens light but if you don't like it I can press ctrl z to undo that kind of transition and let's select another transition has to do with nest and see how it works for example let's say like booming transition let's say now nah, leave this one outside let's say slide let's let's say stretch echo and maybe take the stretch down and then drop into those two nested scripts so when i play back do you see that it's like it had that kind of flavor in transition okay that is the first clip let's go to the second one um, by using the now the common uh, transition which come together here program so let's see how does it work also so for example I go down here um, to the video transitions and let's say for example I'm taking the dissolve transition okay so I'm gonna zoom between these two clips as you can see yeah there we go you see the way this transit like yeah so I'm gonna put the transition between these two clips so I'm going to select that dissolve transition for example let me say I'm going to select film dissolve transition I'm going to put between these two clips as you can see the moment I'm dragging and drop over here so let's so show the way to start and where to end then I'm going to leave it so if I'm going to play it do you see that kind of dissolve it's dissolved from one script to another but sometimes you may not love that kind of effect and you want to do something more with it how will you do that so I'm going to show you you're going to click within that transition you're gonna double click it no you're gonna just single click it and then go into the edit panel click in the effect control so do you see right here show you the transition how it begin how it end and the time in which the transition will take place so you can edit all of this how you you are desired to be as you can see you can manipulate like the shadow cells so you can see how it's going so for example me i can say okay see there are a lot of options there's like a center at cut start at cut end at cut all this option when you, you select them they're gonna do a different thing for example start at cut it will show that transition when the second clip is started end at cut it will show that transition where the first clip is ending but when you say center cut it will cut half by half from the end clip and the starting clip so and the time here is like how duration it is for example uh, i love the shorter time the better for me because i believe um the dissolve transition is kind of interesting that way so i'm gonna put around 10 and when i click ok you see the transition has become smaller and when i'm gonna play it see it's like it's some kind of amazing but i think around 20 to be amazing enough so yeah 20 it is yeah so i think you see how to apply the transition the basic transition so i'm gonna speed up a little bit to put transition because i want to show you how to add the sound behind the transition to make your video even more interesting so for now excuse me i'm gonna do this a little bit faster cheers So yeah sorry guys i'm a little bit faster but fast forward i've already applied all of the transitions in the video but i'm gonna show you how to add some sounds will step up your transition game in the video it's gonna make them even more interesting and back to my computer i've stored some of sounds here uh, in this folder and this sound are variable in the internet you can also download them i'm gonna leave um, some link to those sounds in the description below so for example the sounds um, I'm gonna play them in my application and you're gonna listen to them then you're gonna apply it so I'm gonna drag and drop it over here and I'm gonna listen to it so 
See, like this sound, I love it where it ends, like here. Right there. So I'm gonna select uh, where I like it from and I'm gonna pick it up, start from there. And yeah, I'm gonna drag the sound and drop into the transition, between the transitions. For example, right here, there's always this transition, right here. So I'm gonna apply this sound right here. So when I play, see that? I think you'll feel it. And I'm gonna make it smooth. For example, I'm gonna select the sound and I'm gonna select effect. From where it began, I'm gonna turn the levels down, like real down. And then I'm gonna step a little bit forward arrow until where the transition is about to begin. And I'm gonna select the levels and I'm gonna put it uh, back to zero. Mm, zero. And then I'm gonna make sure, I'm gonna right click in the end one and I'm gonna click is out and where it begin, I'm gonna click is in. And now let's listen to it. It's gonna be like, do you see that? It make your transition stand out. So let's go to a second transition and show you. Uh, we're gonna go back to the folder of sounds and short string. Uh, let's listen to it. So every time you listen to, this, uh, to the transition, if it breaks your ear, use it. If it doesn't, just leave it. Yeah, for example, this one, I know how to use it. I'm gonna select it and I'm gonna use it in this transition somewhere around here. Yeah, right there, it will be perfect. I'm gonna drag and drop as usual. For this one is different, I'm gonna start it from here. Do you see that? Yeah, and I'm gonna click here as usual. I'm gonna select it. I'm gonna go to the effect and I'm gonna select the levels. So from here it will be uh, at zero, but where it ends, I'm gonna put it like minimum. As usual, I'm gonna right click from here. I'm gonna easy out. I'm gonna right click from here and I'm gonna ease in. So it's gonna sound like this. See that so that's how the transition sounds step up your game and as usual i'm gonna fast forward a little bit so i can finish this one a little faster sorry for that ah uh, so yeah as you can see now uh, this is how the transitions are working in my video and the sounds so yeah i just want to show you a little bit of the road how the transitions and the sound is going to affect your video and make your video attractive so i hope nice you've learned something from this and everybody out there uh, for example if you have any question don't hesitate just leave in the comment below or just dm me in my instagram account at abdu and and leave your question over there i'll get back to you as soon as possible and if you want me to do anything else just holler at me and i think this is it for me today i show you how to do the transition and the sounds and i'm going to share with you the final video of how the transition sounds make this video stand out so cheers and thank you guys for being with me don't forget to subscribe comment and like maybe you and this out cheers <laughs> What's up? Welcome to my YouTube channel. My name is Sandra. Other people call me Italian boss babe. <laughs> it has been four years, so I'm about to drop you guys some really good content. So why don't you like and subscribe and keep tuned to what I'm about to show you guys. So I like to travel, go here and there because of my work, but I'm about to show you some of the amazing places that I've been. So I'm about to take a lot of videos and resorts and getaways. So I hope you guys can stay tuned and yeah, subscribe, please, just subscribe. And soon in my other videos, you will also see some more, I'm sure. So here they are. Don't forget to like and subscribe. <laughs>